In this video I'm going to show you how I make my adjustable sliding knot necklaces. You can put whatever pendant you like onto the thread and then we just tie our two barrel knots at the top here so that you can adjust your necklace bigger or smaller. We've got one of our little wire wrapped pendants here which is our paw print one. So you just need something to pop onto your necklace. Then I'm using the two millimeter leather cord today. And we need about 45 inches of our leather cord or you could use waxed twine as well. So I just measure that out and cut it to length. Then we pop our little pendant or whatever you're using onto the cord and push it down somewhere near the middle. Now I lay my cord down on a table and lay it down in a way that I've got this left hand end coming over the top. Then we can pick the necklace up and just holding it in a way that we've got this left hand cord coming at the back. Then with this cord from the back we're going to bring it over the front, down and out the back to create one full loop there. Just holding that little loop gently then we can bring our cord over again to the left hand side of the first loop, over the front, down and out the back to create the second loop there. And then again for the third loop towards the left, over the front, down and out the back. So we need three loops in total. Then we've got our little tail here, so we're just gently going to bend that around and poke it down all three of the little loops there. Then we can just gently wiggle all the cords there to pull this knot down nice and tight. And you should have a really nice tidy little barrel knot there. Now we can swap our necklace onto the other side and we're going to just repeat the same process. Holding it with your cord at the back in your left hand. Then we can just bring this tail over the front, down and out the back to create that first little loop there. Then to the left we go again over the front, down and out the back for our second loop. And then again for our third loop, over the front, down and out the back. Then with our little tail we gently bring it around and poke it down the three loops. Gently pull all your cords nice and tight to create a nice tidy barrel knot. Now you should have two nice little sliding knots there. You can try them out, make sure they're sliding okay up and down and you should be able to pull them to make the necklace longer or pull them up the top here to bring it back a bit shorter. We can cut these little end pieces off as well. I just make sure my knots are really nice and tight and then leave about a centimetre on each side. There's your super simple adjustable sliding knot necklace. 